What's going on, guys? Shane D here, your best friend in the entire world. How you living? How you loving? How you doing? How you growing? How you feeling? How you flowing? How's the kids? How's the wife? How's the hog? How's the dog? How's the farm? How's the house? How's that big city life you're living? Are you doing well? Are you taking good care of yourself? Are you breathing deep? Are you exercising every day? Are you eating right? Eat roughage. Taking your Metamucil if you need to. It's wonderful. Fantastic product. Uh, roughage. Salads. Don't eat hamburgers every day. I'm, I'm learning this. I'm slowly learning. Don't eat hamburgers and hot dogs and fast food every day. Try and do something a little different. Uh, V8. I have V8 juice and I have uh, uh, yogurt every morning. And sometimes even call me a hippie if you want to, but some kombucha. I have kombucha drink every once in a while. So do those things if you can. Uh, request. I went down in the comments and I found uh, possibly one of the greatest uh, subscriber names that I could think of, Otis Spunkmeyer. And he said, bro, if you get a chance, do uh, uh, Diamond Rex. I wish I was rich. And don't we all? We all wish we were rich. I, I wish I was rich. Uh, and, and, and so he wanted to hear some Diamond Rex. Now, I have heard that name. I know nothing about Diamond Rex. I need every single bit of information that you can put in the comments below about Diamond Rex, period. Here's the only fun nugget I have for you on Diamond Rex. When I was a young man, this had to have been 1988 or something, I sloughed school. Don't slough school, by the way. Uh, but I sloughed school. We went over to a, a, a record store. Uh, me and this guy that I knew, uh, hardly knew, kind of, I said, well, where are you going? He says, well, man, I'm going over to the record store, bro. And uh, so we went over to the record store, and he said, see, I'm going to go ahead and skiff a couple of uh, cassette tapes while I'm there. I've got a foolproof plan to do so. Uh, and I went, huh. I was a very good boy. I never did stealing. But I thought, okay, well, uh, let's go in here and do this. So I ended up stealing King Diamond Conspiracy. That was the album that I stole. And the album that, that Dennis, his name was Dennis, Dennis Lemon, uh, the album that he stole was Diamond Rex. And I vaguely remember the cover as being a big frizzy haired guy, maybe in pink, like it looks like the guy's wearing like a pink t-shirt or something. And I wanna say he was doing like one of those rock star kind of poses or something. I could be completely wrong, but I remember going Diamond Rex. I still King Diamond Conspiracy, you still Diamond Rex. Okay. I had never heard of him then. I do not hear of him now. I've never heard anything from Diamond Rex, just that name. So Otis Spunkmeyer, this is for you. Um, Daddy's got the channel changer right here. Going to hit the button. Going to watch I Wish I Was Rich by Diamond Rex. Here we go. Bang. <laughs> Looks like the illegitimate brother of Nikki Six. Not. So not really. Carving off the benches. He's just talking about his work day, isn't he? These guys are definitely hair metal. Shower. 
Yeah, forget it. No, you guys don't get to have your pictures. You think if they, when they saw this video, that they went? Uh, you think, you think when they, when they first, uh, when they, when they first saw this video for the first time, they're like, boy, what a great video we've done here. I can't wait till each one of our images pop up. The still photos of each one of us pop up at the end, and just that one guy pops up, and they're like, bro, what the fuck? I thought we were all going to have our still photos at the end. No, nah, we decided to edit you guys out. Uh, what say you put it all in the comments below. Tell me everything you know about Diamond Rex. I know nothing, so I need to learn. Feed me, Seymour. Feed me. Give me all the delicious goodies you can about Diamond Rex. Can you do that? Can you do that for Daddy? It would be much appreciated. I read all the comments. I love it. I love when you interact with the videos and you talk to each other and you talk to me about what you have learned or what you know about the bands that we do here on this channel. Uh, like, comment, subscribe, be my friend, tell a friend, share one of these videos on your Twitter feed. Do you have one of those? Say, check out this asshole. Um, that's all I got. Check out my links below, guys. I've got my Patreon where you can go and hear me sing karaoke and all sorts of stuff that you're not going to see on YouTube. I've got t-shirts that you can check out. And I think there's some pretty cool designs in there. Just take a look around and peeksy, peeksy poo at that. Or if you have a request and you want me to do your song for you, and it has to be rock, metal, punk, something like that. Not, not R. Kelly, and not R. Kelly's P tape or something like that. Hard rock, heavy metal, something like that. You got a request, go to the paypal.me slash TV. All those links are below. Uh, that's all I've got. Swinging in for Kiss. Loving you so much. Thanking you so much for your, for, for your patronage, for your, your, your courtesy, your kindness, your thumbs ups, your comments, and your positive, positive mental attitude. Swinging in for Kiss. Loving you so much. Mm.